Hello, I just got back from the fish store and I happened to pick up new fish. I will tell you what these are in a bit. I'm going to go ahead and put them in the tank right here and let them acclimate for a little bit and I will show you them off shortly. So I got new fish I want to show off, but first I'm going to need your help as well. Uh, not with these new fish, uh, but it's uh, basically a new segment I'm going to be doing. Um, basically it goes back to one of the reasons why I'm doing these videos is basically so I could learn more about the aquarium hobby um, and basically express what I, I know in this hobby. Uh, but primarily I, I do want to learn more and the only way I'm going to learn more is if I actually go out there and do some research. And what I need from you guys is some topics. So if you have any questions, if you want to know any of my thoughts on a certain subject in the aquarium hobby, uh, please drop me a line in the comments or you can actually email me at dave at aquariumthoughts.com. Uh, give me questions, give me topics to talk about, and I will do some of my research because that is one way I do learn things is by actually researching it online, uh, checking out forums, and basically forming my own opinion on how to do things. Uh, I know a lot of it as well that I can't really do all the time is basically actually get the fish, try it out and see how I do, do the, do the little experimentation. But primarily I do want to do some research and get, get going on that. That way I can educate myself more on the aquarium hobby. And if, if, if I don't have a topic that I, I really want to research, I'm not going to go do it. So what I want is topics from you guys, questions from you guys, and that way I can do the research and I can give you an answer of, of how I see it. Um, now, of course, keep in mind, it, it might, it's just going to be my thoughts on the matter. Um, always one thing I always recommend is do your own research. Don't rely on one source, no matter how knowledgeable you think that person is. Do your own research on the subject matter and see what you think and go go with that. So anyways, let's, let's go check out my new fish I got. This is a new fish that I, I found at my fish store today. I, I've been going there the last few weeks just to check out. I've been looking for a certain fish that they haven't got in, but I was in there today and these fish actually caught my eye. Something I liked the look of and I decided, nope, I'm going to put it in my tank. Um, when, I, when the actual fish I want comes in, I can re, re, basically rehome some of the fish in my tank. Probably uh, get rid of a few of the S, SBI reservoirs. I do have a lot in here. I, since I fell in love with them, I just kept on buying, 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 but I still do love them. I just kind of want to rehome a few maybe. That way I could actually have the stock I like in there. So let's go take a look at the new fish I have in here. So let's go see it. So this is a view from within my tank right now. Um, I'm actually in the center right there. You have a couple of the new fish I have, which is going to be the albino neon tetras. I saw these at the uh, fish store today and I just fell in love with them. I, I wish I could have a whole tank of them, but I just had to have a few. And I think these will probably school well with the lone uh, neon tetra I have in here. Uh, because I know when I had, uh, when I bought a lot of these small cardinals, which these are a few of them right there. They're larger now, but what happened was one of them happened to be a small neon tetra and you can't really tell them they feel it grew up a little bit larger. But that is one of the fish I got that was new, which is the albino neon tetra. It's a white fish with a red tail. And I'm hoping the, uh, I, I do see a little bit of the uh, blue line that the neons have as well. Um, I'm hoping as they get a acclimated to this tank more that that will really come out and shine uh, the red in these things in these fish are really coming out a little bit better than what I seen them earlier but they are really 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 a nice looking fish um, there's a couple other fish I got in here which is going to be right over here if I can get a picture of them it's just another albino which is the albino rummy nose to go along with my other rummy nose that you could see right there in here uh, those are the two fish I got that I found at the fish store today and decided, no, I need to have these fish. Um, so there, there's the two fish I got new that's in this tank to go along with my, of course, my SBI Rasboras. Uh, that one is really a nice orange. Uh, because one of the albino 
Remy noses. Uh, so basically that is what along with the asking for the assistance on um, the help basically giving me ideas to talk about uh, that way you ask what hey what are my thoughts on certain subjects uh, so basically feel free to leave those questions or topics in the comments or you can actually email them to me like I said at Dave at Aquarium Thoughts uh, if you want to be anonymous uh, you can email me and just don't leave a uh, YouTube name um, if you do email me and you want to be known, just give me your YouTube no name as well. And that way when I do the video, I will mention your name on there as well. So I'm just going to take a little bit more footage on this. Um, just to show you the inside of my tank right now. As you can see, you can see a couple of those albino neons in the background right there. I just love how they stand out, especially when I'm filming here. Uh, they are a very, very, very interesting looking fish. Let's see here. And of course, there's the uh, albino rummy nose, which kind of just looks like a translucent fish. Uh, you can just look through. There it is, right there. There's a nice looking one of them on the left hand side, right there. So, that's what I wanted to show you this week. And there, of course, goes one of my out of sync lists, kind of just kind of swimming by and trying to find a place to rest. So that's that, and you guys have a great day, night, or whenever you're watching this. Thank you.